Hey there, I'm Nate at Twisted Throttle and I'm gonna show you guys our all new Power Hub 2 by Denali. Uh, this is a power distribution module. It's also referred to as a master ground block and a master fuse block. And what that allows you to do is consolidate all of your accessory wiring into one clean, simple area. So all of the hots and all the grounds go into this unit and it gives it a really clean look on your bike and it gives you access to all the fuses for all your electronics in one spot. If you weren't using a power hub, you'd have all of your hots and all of your grounds running through the bike, going to the battery, clogging up your ring terminals, and actually stashing fuses in all different places. It makes it really hard to, to diagnose when you trip a circuit and have to replace a fuse. So we've had great success with our power hub one that we've previously been selling, and the power hub two has the same basic functionality but we've just made a handful of improvements that's going to make it a lot easier to install and easier to use on your bike. So um, one of the first things you'll notice right off the bat is a different housing. Um, we've got a lower profile housing here that's a lot more weather resistant um, and sealed. And we're using uh, some rubber retention straps that keeps the lid on um, so you can access the unit without using any kind of tools. Now, once you're inside the unit, one of the first things you'll notice is that we've relocated the ground bus and the 12 volt output bus inside the unit um, as opposed to the outside. So what that means is that all of your hot and ground wires from your accessories are going to come in one spot and be routed to the terminals inside. So that creates just uh, a really clean um, exit of the wires as they route through the bike. One of the other major changes is we're using a replaceable relay with a built-in resistor so it's CAN bus compatible um, and that's going to allow you to replace the relay if necessary as opposed to having it soldered to the board. Now the other thing you'll notice is we, we stepped it up to a, a really heavy duty um, 10 gauge wire for the, for the hot lead and the ground lead and that's a high strand count wire so that's going to be super flexible and really easy to, to route to your battery. So right now we've got the all new Power Hub 2 installed on this R1200GS and we've got six accessories running to it so we can take a little bit more uh, closer look at how it's installed. So if we pop the cover off here we can uh, take a quick look to the inside and um, right off the bat you're going to see the ground bus and the 12 volt output bus. So um, essentially to install this product all you really need to do is run you're hot to the battery and you're ground to the battery and then there's a trigger wire and that's going to go to any switched uh, 12 volt power source so the unit gets powered um, when the ignition of the bike is turned on. Now all of these circ all six circuits can either be set up to be switched or constant power and what that means is you can either you know access you can either run power to the accessory with the bike off or switched power means when you turn your key ignition, it's gonna access, uh, it's gonna bring the power to the electronics then. And that's just a matter of putting the fuse in the either switched or constant part of the fuse holders here. Um, and then once you get the uh, power and ground wired up and your trigger wire, you just have to bring the hot and ground wire from each of your accessories um, right through the side grommet here into the ground bus and the 12 volt power bus. Um, the last little step you would want to do is we provide a decal on the inside cover that's going to allow you to record what accessory um, is put into what circuit so you've got a great reference guide so you can uh, replace the fuses if necessary. So as you can see here we've got the Power Hub 2 completely installed on this R1200GS. We've got uh, six accessories going to it and it just looks really clean, looks like it came right out of the factory like this. Um, if you need any more information on this product, please don't hesitate to give us a call or visit us at twistedthrottle.com.